Today marks a milestone in Tambia to Jenge, Kenya. We have completed one year since we began October the 2nd, 2020. It was the roughest of times because the COVID pandemic had really gripped Kenya and we were bleeding economically, especially when it came to hotels being open, when it came to jobs being secured. Hotels were sacking people, laying them off every single day. And um, that's when we got together and thanks to the PDU, we agreed that we need to restart this program. And if you ask me, because I've been the ambassador since then, uh, my problem was getting Kenyans to overcome the fear. The fear was everything. But as soon as I got the messaging right that keep safe, keep your distance, stay in a bubble, but travel, we started opening up as a country. Uh, we've been through one great year of adventures and wonderful memories. We've done 20 counties in year one, which was really good. Um, 27 trips. We visited 81 hotels all around this country. The bed conversion is what I'm really happy about because Kenyans have heeded the call to Tembea, to Jenge, Kenya, because you've got more than 36,000 bed conversions all over this country, which I think is a big, big number. We've had more than 600 on-ground participants. On social media, where we mainly run the campaign, it was very successful with more than 1,200 social media posts averaging a reach of about 2 million shillings per post. Infrastructure, because we also did that. Uh, we visited more than 30 roads in 11 counties, some of which I never even knew existed. The infrastructure in this country is immense. There is no reason why we can't Tembea to Jenge, Kenya. Uh, the good thing is hotels have seen the value. And um, as I stand here now, I can uh, confidently say that you have all traveled somewhere. You have all stayed in a lodge or a hotel somewhere around this country, and uh, the statistics show it. We might think it's a joke, but Kenyans need to come out to visit our areas, visit our parks, visit our coastline. Very beautiful indeed, and natural. And the best thing is now Kenyans are going out with their kids. I think CBC is the best thing ever because now children are going to learn about their country in different counties and they can come back and give their story. Also when it comes to reliance on foreign tourism, international tourism, we need to look for a local solution. And that local solution is local tourism. If you look at uh, Tembea to Jenge, Kenya, it has been structured to visit every county in this country. The whole idea is to ensure we discover and visit all the gems which exist. Every county has a unique, whether it's food tourism, whether it's cultural tourism, whether it's the coastline, whether it's the mountains. Uh, as Isuzu East Africa, uh, we've put in a number of vehicles uh, to help discover these exotic destinations across the country. Uh, Tembea to Jenge, Kenya um, has realized uh, its goal, getting Kenyans to appreciate this country. If you look at the name, I have heard people saying Tembea Kenya, is Tembea to Jenge Kenya. There is a reason for the to Jenge. There is an economic impact. Everywhere you visit, a shilling spent in Nairobi is totally different shilling spent in Turkana, or in Amboseli, or in uh, Bungoma, because definitely we work with different dynamic economic situations. So the whole idea, even as we travel, and we are, as we tembea, to Najenga, we are building our fellow Kenyans. And that's why when we came with this initiative, we are very keen on pushing the concept of domestic tourism. So families traveling was one of the big advantages of year one of Tembea to Jenge, Kenya. Mombasa, our White Sands Hotel, has been busy, and I can tell you, it was Kenyans. Uh, the lodges in the Mara, in Nakuru, in Shaba, it was Kenyans. So thank you very much, Asante Nisana. Uh, but we are here, and we are here to, to thank God and to give thanks, uh, not only to my sponsors, but I must say Isuzu East Africa. Thank you so much, Duncan and the rest of the team. Shell, Vivo Energy have been our chief partner. We are continuing with them. Sarova Hotels who are hosting us today. Thank you so much, Sarova. Uh, the Tourism Fund, Asante Sana, because they relay their messages. Every hotel pays a 2% training levy, 
and they have actually justified it for the hotels by giving them a lot of marketing in everything we do. We must thank Safaricom. Safaricom have kept us connected everywhere we've been. St. John's Ambulance, thank you so much, Dr. Tai, for being here. Madison Group, Jane and the rest of the gang, thank you so much for joining in because you kept us covered. St. John's, you kept us safe. And we are looking forward to year two. We've been given another two-year appointment uh, by the PDU, so we are looking forward to executing it very, very well. But the most important thing is we are here to give thanks. We thank you for the gift of life. We thank you for our beautiful Kenya because you've enabled us to enjoy uh, wonderful resources, natural resources that many uh, envy, you know, all over the world. Father, Tembea Kenya is a great initiative to um, show Kenyans that uh, they can travel within their country. And with Tembea Kenya phase two coming up, we can only uh, pray for uh, great results because we are thanking you for what has happened in phase one. Without you, Lord, all each and every person who has been on the road, each and every participant in this uh, initiative, you have covered them, you have protected them, you have even given us good results as sponsors, and we thank you, Lord, we don't take it for granted. Uh, to every Kenyan watching, thank you for always believing in your country. If we don't do this, who will? By the time our foreign visitors are economically even able to travel on holiday, it's going to take some time because COVID hit every economy really hard. Unless we do it ourselves, we can't afford to shut down hotels and lose jobs anymore. We've got an economy to grow, an industry to grow, and a country to run. So thank you so much for making time to be with us today. Um, for those traveling to Altukai, I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Uh, those who are not going to travel, be safe. Uh, thank you so much, Jane, for your prayers. And to the man upstairs, thank you so much for everything. To everyone, sponsors, staff, my colleagues at uh, BT and TTK, and to members of the fourth estate, Asante Sana. Let the weekend begin to Tembe, to Jenga. Thank you. Damn, you look good tonight.